new speed? Okay. Now, it's time to research marketing and then we'll make the... What the hell? Oh, research points are too low. All right, let's make a new engine. Hold on. Joystick steering wheel, okay. We're good. Create custom engine. This will be called Frostbitten 2. It will have all this cool stuff, plus this, 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 and this. Now what can we take out of here? We can take out nothing. Great engine. We're down to two million. We don't want to dip below that. We will, but we don't want to dip too much further below. We're going to try to keep ourselves above two million at all times. From time to time, your employees need to recharge the battery and go on vacation. Uh... Oh, fuck, we can't send you on vacation, Justin. We need you. Shit, his efficiency is lowering. After we finish the engine, then maybe. Better dialogues, now they're working in better AI. Good. Okay. You better be back soon, Justin. Wait, wait a second. How long does it take for them to come back? Until it refills? Please be until it refills. Justin? Justin! Oh, there he is. Okay, now it's time to... Industry news. They've announced a successor. Fans around the world have been waiting for the Super TES. Yeah, I bet you guys have. Okay, let's make it small game. It's going to be on the Vena Oasis. Game engine is going to be Frostbitten 2. Let's make it... Hmm. Superheroes. Adventure game. Next. Oh god, this is going to be expensive. Character progression. Gameplay's got to be up there. Story and quests have to be up there too. Next. Alright, I hope this one works well. Hi, I'm Steve O'Connell, a reporter for Planet GG. We've heard a rumor that your company is developing a game for mature audiences. Would you be willing to give an interview about this? Cool. That should give us some hype. I should have researched marketing for this game. Hmm. Okay. Whew, this had better get a lot of good reviews. We think that players are looking for more mature content in games, and we're willing to take a risk to give it to them. Many industry experts say that sooner or later, games with mature themes will become more common. Oh god, I hope it's common enough to make a lot of sales. 8.8 thousand .8, fans. Okay. We're down to 1.5 million. Is it better get us over two? Hype is 12. Nice. All right, finish game. 29 and 15. With a design in 29, that should look fantastic. This should be a great game. Look at all those level ups. All right, give me good reviews, please. New research available. Multiplayer, branching story, dialogue tree, AI companions, 2D graphics, 3D graphics. I chose the wrong time to make a new engine. Oh shit, come on, come on, hi. Yes. Fuck, I forgot to name it. I've been forgetting to name the last couple games. Seven and ten, ten, nine is good. Nice. Now let's see those sales. Oh, Super TES has been released. Good. Not selling that much though. How much did this thing cost to make? Game history, Jesus Christ. 
184,000. We just broke even recently. Hmm. Okay, let's do some research a minute. Let's research new topics. Werewolf. Level editor, marketing. Let's do marketing. Now we're going to develop a new game. It's going to be called Injustice. No. It's going to be a RPG game. It's going to be for everyone. The topic is going to be fantasy casual. The platform is the game link. Game engine Frostbitten 2. 2D graphics. Alright. Let's take out cutscenes and that should be okay. Story and quest has got to be pretty high. That should be decent. Alright. Game 14 is slowing down in sales. You've successfully unlocked marketing. Let's market this game. Not yet. Okay, now let's market the game. I'm gonna choose magazines. It's the cheapest one. 50,000 bucks. Hype number two. Number three, hype. Okay, world design level four. Doesn't need that. Guess it doesn't need that either. Hmm. Fuck it. We'll leave it at that. Hard decision, though. Alright. Give me more hype, please. I paid for it. Bugs! Oh no, it seems like it has quite a few undiscovered bugs when we released it. Some of our customers are having a bad time with this game and they demand that we patch it. Alright. So now off the market, let's uh let's fix those bugs. I'm gonna have you to yeah. We're gonna make Justin patch game number 14. And we are now going to release Skyrim. In a surprise announcement, Vani, a company known for general electronics, has presented a prototype console called the Play System. Apparently, Vani has collaborated with Nenvento, creators of the beloved TES and Super TES. This would be the world's first console to use a CD drive. Journalists around the world are baffled as only one day after John, uh, Vani and Nenvento jointly announced the Play System and Internet uh, conference things have turned sour. Huh. They're canceling the project. Okay, these are too many pop-ups. Yeah, shut up! By the way, that's something real that happened in Vent uh, Nintendo and uh, Sony. Shit! My hype went down! Fuck you! Yeah, they're going to, uh... Release the CD console together, but instead it became the PlayStation when things turned sour. Skyrimmed. Please be high. Falls short? I knew I should have stayed in my garage. Disappointing. Have seen better. Fun at stages. Shit. Well, let's see how well it does. It's not doing well. One fan said, I love companies like Like a Boss. They just don't milk the customers for money. They also understand our concerns and make sure we can enjoy our games. In two months, it will be taken off the market. Hmm. Seems that after the initial sales of Skyrim have fallen. Ah, it's fallen. It's unpopular with everyone. Well, thank you guys for watching this uh, video on Like a Boss uh, Game Developer Tycoon 2013. Oh shit, I didn't mean to press that. 
Don't try to hire everyone at once. The staff is expensive. Yep, it is. Oh, here it is. Okay, save game. Thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like this video, favorite, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you again next time. Take care.